Hey people, this is Zach from the arcade. Yeah, I'm just gonna go out and um, tell you guys. Yeah, I was gonna do a Carthage campaign, but I just really um, things went bad because I lost the saved game data that I had. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. My computer restarted when I was making middle of making one of my commentaries for it. So, uh, since I already quit a Broody Eye campaign, I thought I'd bring it back. Uh, even though I don't have the save data from that game, I'm just gonna start over. Uh, it, so I will be taking the Carthage campaign things off the channel. Sorry. Alright, well, let's get started. Um, anybody that's watched me on System of a Demon knows that uh, knows what I do here, so, yeah, you'll be seeing a lot of what I did in that campaign that I was doing a system of a demon in this campaign. Alright, let's get started, um, I'm gonna show any of you players that are not familiar to the game. Here, um, this is an easy strategy, you can pick this up anywhere, actually. Alright, sorry, I kind of skipped that part. Yeah, it was kind of boring. And I had to reset my timer. Uh, I don't know. It, I, if I uh, explain to you, I'll go up on a ramble about it. So I'm just not going to explain it. You leave it up to your imagination why I skipped that part. There you go. Alright, so uh, if you've seen me uh, when I was System of a Demon, you know this is my strategy all time on attacking these open cities. Uh, so, let's, yeah, you, you guys will easily know this. It's just, uh, infantry charge through one point when my infantry have engaged their infantry. My cavalry will soon come in and kill them. It looks like they have indeed decided to pelt my, or they're getting ready to deport, pelt my cavalry with their missiles, and I'm not going to allow that, because my general is in that unit, and, yeah. and by the time their spearmen, phalanx, whatever you want to call it, the militia hoplites, will be here, I will already be out, and my infantry will already be in. So... That's pretty much all. <laughs> Alright. Um, I'm really sorry, guys. I was planning to go through with the, camp the Carthage campaign, but it just didn't work out. That's how some things end up. I'm really sorry about it. I wish I could have continued it, because it was a real good, fun campaign for me. I love Carthage. But I really don't want to restart. i just not in the mood to restart this. And I thought... I wanted to, I really felt sad about that, and I really wanted to show you guys the Carthage campaign, but at the same time, I remembered that I had not finished the Broody Eye campaign either on System of a Demon, so I decided this is what I'm going to do. I will finish this up and maybe do, no, I'm not even going to make plans, I'm going to, maybe I'll get a couple fans and have feedback at that point, so, I don't know what's going to happen, let's leave it up to fate, or whatever, whatever you, whatever you're, whatever you want to say, alright there, I just the killed enemy the enemy general, general. Is dead. His uh, men know their doom approaches. and now we just have to deal with this last trooper, let's see how he holds up against my overwhelming horses, and he didn't hold up good at all because my horse is trampled. I lost, I think, like, three soldiers out of all that. Um, two soldiers. Amazing. <laughs> it just, the rebels just, the AI, actually, is what I'm trying to say, it makes me wonder why they made this game exactly why they did and see, my mission was successful, I gained 5,000 denarii, good, so, 
build the governor's house. Um, if you've ever seen any of my videos, you know why I build the governor's house. And if you're new, I'm gonna tell you. It is because... <laughs> Alright, when your population's enough to expand, is ready and willing to expand, um, they will get angry if you don't hurry and build them a, a government house, like show of superiority and they're being governed and all that nice jazz that's going down. They will get angry very quickly, so I just like to go ahead and build it. Alright, a suitable husband. Uh, let's, this is good. I always enjoy extra generals. And then I'm gonna have to blockade the port of Syracuse. It's okay, the Greeks, well, it's owned by the Greeks if you haven't already known this. Uh, I will be going to war with them soon, probably right after I finish this mission anyways. Because the, they will ask me to attack Thermon. That's why. Ugh. Okay, let's get things rolling here. I got an equite ready. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh, ooh, I already got that built. That was fast. Alright, cool. Let's end this turn, and of course I'll accept your trade rights, Macedon, because I won't have to kill you for the time being. There's your explanation. Okay, I'm making a profit. This is a good thing. Oh man, this brings me back to when I was System of a Demon. Which, that wasn't too long ago either, so... I don't know. Okay, I think this is a suitable army to take the city of Thermon with. Uh, oof, I'm gonna build a militia barracks so I would enjoy to have something better than... Uh, <laughs> Town Watch, because Town Watch are just... Ooh! Huh. Well, guys, you can say I'm wrong, because guess what? I have to attack Salone. And instead of Thermon, like I already thought. And, and Salone, four units of rebels. No, that's, that's nothing. So I'm not gonna, I'm gonna treat it as it is, and send nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna send a crap army, uh... Five units, I have to overpower them. That's just... The only way I'm really gonna win is if I have overpowering numbers. Training will have nothing to do with it. Um, that's probably not what you guys want to use in a strategy. But sometimes, that's just what's gonna have to happen. You see, a fairly okay army, it's not a good army but it is not a bad army. So, alright, I'm gonna build a shrine to Mars here because I would enjoy to have... I I'm not sure if, like, the shrine to Mars has gives you, like, a special weapon type thing or, like, a special unit, but, yeah. Alright, let's end this turn because things are going good for Zach. <sighs> okay, um, yeah, and if anybody wants to know, uh, why... Colton hasn't put up a video yet, uh, just don't ask, I'm not gonna tell you, I, honestly, I know, but I'm not, I'm not sure if that's still the reason, but, he will have one soon, so wait for that. Colton's probably the only one to be, will be to view this, cause I don't have any really subscribers, maybe a couple, I don't know. Uh, oh, no, I'm losing money. My goodness. That's not good. Um. <laughs> gosh, I'm saying um too much. I'm sorry, guys. I'm gonna not say um. And if you wonder why I'm sighing, it's just because I'm tired. I've been doing quite a bit of work lately, which I'm not used to. Alright, let's go ahead and assault, and assault this town with overpowering numbers, and actually some of my men are skilled, so... Triple threat, right? I only have a couple more minutes, so I might, yeah, I'm gonna finish up this battle, and that's all I can really do. Because I think I have like two or three minutes. 
Um, okay, we're gonna do exam. <laughs> sorry, I'm saying um too much. Alright, anyways, we're gonna do exactly what we did last time. The same exact freaking thing. Except I'm in a... I have quite a few more men. And different sorts of soldiers. But it's superiorly the exact same freaking thing. So, I'm gonna actually have my uh, horses at a hill advantage for for this part, because what if some of my men get engaged? And I mean engaged like in the tech. Alright, so, my alarm just went off to stop the stop the video, but I'm gonna keep going. I'm just gonna finish up this battle. And I don't know, can I auto resolve this? Nope, I lose the battle. And I'm not gonna lose the battle because the battle is won only with persistence and strength. Don't ask me who that is, because I just made that up. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know if that's really how you win a battle. I just made something that sounded wise, a couple words that sounded good. Alright, I'm gonna, um, speed this up so I'll have more time. I'll just have to leave the split decisions up to my split decision time maker. And I will make my own time. So, I'm gonna, my soldiers will be moving up. And I think I will try to engage my militia hoplites while I bring my soldiers in. Engage these soldiers so my Yep, look. Right on cue. Alright, I'm gonna slow things down. I have to make sure I can make split second decisions, cause that's just well, that's how you kinda have to do things. And yay, the enemy general was killed with a gay ish Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. I guess gauge is a word. I don't know. Um, the Sicilian pirates? That's how you spell Sicilian. I don't even know if that word is Sicilian. I believe it is. Um, they're interesting fellas, do uh, They fight with shirts off, tattoos on the back, and in skirts with only axes. Yeah, they're. Uh, they, oh, look, look. They have their own spears. Of course they do. They're Sicilian pirates. All of the Sicilian pirates now carry one. I'm sure there are pirates in Sicilia. But you know what? I don't know. I'm gonna actually not make a fool of myself and not lose my general in this battle. Cause that would just make me look like at my strategy came out my butt. Alright, I'm gonna speed this up because I am probably way over the time limit. And yes I am. Alright, let's just finish this up. Alright, cool. Well, I will see you next time. Peace out.